much for waiting. I'm really sorry about that. Oh, okay. I've had to wait way longer. Okay. <laughs> Nice we just need to go through and make One sure all the pages are here. So I'll just sit here on page post office. Sit here and throw them through. Yeah, if you guys want to send any messages or anything, we'll be around. <laughs> oh, that's true. If it's the one, it does the... What are you, a filmmaker? No. I think you got some instincts there. You might want to... <laughs> 
That's about as far as we go. <laughs> On camera. He's not here. He's not here. Okay. I can um let's see. Ted Ted around. He just we were filming for his bill. Um so I just for West Wing Week. Hand it to you. Okay. Thanks. Thank you, Ted. We'll do it. Thank you. I have more in just for that. <laughs> just this one in particular one I want to film for. Okay.
I'm just going to make a brief, brief statement about uh, the importance of this bill and the outstanding work that all of you did uh, helping to make it happen. I will sign the bill. Um, I'm then actually uh, going to answer a question about the shooting that took place in Wisconsin, uh, just because uh, this will be the first uh, public uh, uh, appearance that I've made since that happened. And they'll be very brief, uh, so bear with me. And then after that's done, uh, we'll, we'll all go in front of the tape, uh, in front of the desk, and we'll take a good picture. Okay? And I suspect each of you will get one of these spiffy pens. <laughs> all right. Okay. All right. Yeah, you know, the uh, pizza. <laughs> pizza. <laughs> uh, my cable's broke. <laughs> Come on in, everybody. All right. Don't, don't, don't knock anything over now. Well, uh, I want to thank everybody who uh, is here because they all did outstanding work in helping to get uh, this legislation uh, completed. Uh, as you know, I think all Americans feel we have a moral, sacred duty uh, towards our men and women in uniform. They protect our freedom, and it's our obligation to do right by them. Uh, this bill takes another important step in fulfilling that commitment. I want to thank the members of Congress uh, who helped to make this happen. Uh, it is going to have an immediate impact. It improves access to health care. It streamlines services of the VA. Uh, it expands support for veterans who are homeless. There are two parts of the bill, though, that I especially want to highlight. Uh, first of all, this bill uh, ends a decade-long struggle uh, for those who serve at Camp Lejeune. Uh, some of the veterans and their families who are based in Camp Lejeune uh, in the years when the water was contaminated, we'll now have access to expanded medical care. Uh, and sadly, uh, this act alone will not bring back those who've lost, uh, including uh, Janie Hensminger, but uh, it will honor their memory by making a real difference uh, to those who are still suffering. The second part of this bill uh, that I want to highlight uh, prohibits protesting within 300 feet of military funerals uh, during the two hours before and two hours after a service. Uh, I supported this step as a senator. Uh, I am very pleased to be signing uh, this bill uh, into law. Uh, you know, the graves of our veterans are hallowed ground. And uh, obviously, uh, we all defend our Constitution and the First Amendment and free speech, uh, but we also believe that when men and women die in the service of their country uh, and are laid to rest, it should be done with the utmost honor and respect. Uh, so I'm glad that Congress passed this bill, and uh, I hope that uh, we can continue to do some more good bipartisan work in protecting our veterans. For a veterans job for that uh, could help provide additional opportunities for uh, the men and women who are coming home uh, as we're winding down uh, our operations in Afghanistan and having ended the war in Iraq. Uh, and so this is a good sign of. Uh, a bipartisan spirit that I'm sure is going to carry through all the way to Election Day and beyond. Um, with that, I'm going to sign the bill. I'll make sure I sign the right place. Though.
these kinds of terrible, tragic events uh, are happening with too much regularity uh, for us not to do some soul searching and to examine additional ways that we can reduce violence. And uh, as I've already said, I think there are a lot of elements involved in it. And what I want to do is to bring together law enforcement, community leaders, faith leaders, uh, elected officials at every level uh, to see how we can make continued progress. Uh, we don't yet know fully uh, what motivated this individual to carry out this terrible act. Uh, if it turns out, as some early reports indicate, that uh, it may have been motivated in some way by uh, the ethnicity of those who were attending the temple. Uh, I think the American people immediately recoil against those kinds of attitudes. And uh, I think it will be very important for us to uh, reaffirm once again uh, that in this country, uh, regardless of what we look like, where we come from, uh, who we worship, uh, we are all one people. And we look after one another. And we respect one another. Um, but uh, as I said, the FBI is working with local officials uh, and they're still uh, investigating uh, what motivated this individual. Uh, and as we find out more, uh, I suspect that uh, uh, not only uh, the White House, but uh, uh, others in Congress and uh, at the local level will have more to say. We uh, thank, you thank, you you thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. These guys have a tough job. So they got to get on their knees. It gets a little stiff. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks again. Yes, sir. I know, man. It wasn't. It, it, all my birthday. Uh, my birthday on Saturday. It all happened in, in, in the night, mm -hmm. overnight. Uh, uh, you know, I was going fine until like fifty-one. At least you're not like me. Yeah, that's right. I got some. I got some. Come on over here, guys. All right. So, why don't we get uh, one more person over on this side? Yes. Um, come on, sir. Thank you so much. Keep up the good work. Honor. Thank you. Thank you so much. One of our producers is your staff person. Did you know? Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. She, is that right? She, she, she actually produced the, she, the shoot. She shot the film, some of the film. Good for you. You know, I, I knew there was something I liked it better. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you again. Thank you. Appreciate it. Come on, Bob, why don't you get over here and get a little bit of picture with the other thing? This one. This one. Oh, wrong Miller. Okay. Yeah, this so, one. She just said, she said Ms. Miller. I was like, I want to get on the other side. Come on. Thank you, Mr. President. Come on. You stay in here. Stay in here. Come on, stay in here. I don't need to shift it up.
That motto and slogan are very much alive and well down at the unit and operating level. However, Look, this, 